Hello guys, this is Idon Power and yeah, I received a message from somebody saying I have to check on, on the XYZ as you can see on the 2010 and Y on 10 which is level 10 and 129 in here which is this is 129 behind me as you can see I found diamonds and yeah, I was so happy and I thank you very much for that guys. Uh, thanks mate, you know. and. I love diamonds and uh, so if you want to find them yourself as well guys just um, please check on here 2010 the X and the Y on 10 and the Z on 129 it doesn't mean anything that F well this is when you find your diamonds so yeah and I did so thank you very much and this is cool and now I'm gonna dig them out but before I dig them out I like to break all over the place you know the stones case there is a lava or anything you know dangerous stuff okay let's use these ones and get rid of them any more diamonds up there no so with my fortune diamond pickaxe hopefully I will double them or even a little bit more maybe because it's times a three so I wish I got it times five but it's okay oops I almost got that one as well Okay, so I just dug my way into that tunnel. I'll be showing it to you how I walked in here. All right, and I think there is a three in here, so this is cool. Three. Okay, any more in there? Okay. All right. Um, let's. Let's get first these golden blocks. Will they double these ones? No. No, I don't think anything works with that. So let's get the diamonds and let's break all that. So my pickaxe almost gone as well. Okay, that's done. Okay, guys, let's see how many we got now out of these three diamonds. So that's one. Wow. Is it five from three we got five diamonds beautiful thank you very much mate uh, this is so cool now I'm happy <laughs> yep yeah guys we try to help each other you know and uh, I left you some messages in my videos as well about diamonds and stuff like this how to find them so yeah just check them out and I really hope you do find these diamonds as well okay I don't want oops I'm not, I don't don't use your fortune because you don't want to waste it for nothing guys okay let's put some torches in here uh, we'll talk about that room later on and continue probably searching from that way so yeah this is the way I walked in as you can see this is the you know the room facing the tunnel as you can see this is where I normally go mining and I went that way because I was watching the XYZ and I end up on that corner so as you can see it said 2012 and level 11 so I dropped down and followed my way in as you can see the Z is going down 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 and poop facing them and I got them right so if you want to find them the way guys it should be easy as well yeah that's cool anyway I lit in that place up so let's lock it I don't need to come that way now got my business done in here I need to go do some farming I just came that way because I wanted to get these stuff and cool I got some diamonds which is beautiful I got some gold and yep these stuff are cooked that's very good I'll probably leave that one in there you know what I'll take it home with me and I'll leave it in there Okay, and I need the gold to take with me. Anything I need to take from here? No, nothing. Okay, five precious diamonds, beautiful. And yeah, this is so cool now. It, and it looks like it's raining, I think. That weather looks like rainy weather. You know, it's like a grayish color. Yeah, it is raining, <laughs> I was right. I was right. Okay. 
And yeah, as you can see my stuff, my plantation is looking cool in here. I already moved all my stuff from these chests, you know, to the house I just built in there. And I think I have nothing in these things. And this is my new texture pack, guys. Yeah, as you can see, the colors of the chest is changed. The wood, the, the crafting table is changed as well. And this is the cauldron. As you can see, the color of it, it looks beautiful like this. I'll try to make it like a red sink. <laughs> the furnaces, I'll be working on them as well. These wood pressure plates is that it changed. Even the torches, the, the colors of these wood thing, I changed it. And yeah, as you can see, righty then. And the doors colors changed. The signs colors changed. Everything, you know, I'm trying to change in this. Yeah, you know what, let's skip the night before we have some problems in the way. I have five diamonds. I don't need any hassle. So let's put this, mu this hassle behind this muscle. <laughs> All right behind this bed <laughs> right the daylight looking good and this is my new glowstone guys it's not been released yet you know i'm still really really working hard on it so it will be a while as well um because i have lots of things i never changed in my previous texture so i wanted to change it in here so hopefully it will look great as well okay now i wanted to do oh, i think i brought that pickaxe it's almost worn anyway i could use it in here and the shovel cool I need don't tell me there's creepers in here and the fences colors as you can see guys the wood I made this wood color it looks absolutely different cooler a million times I think it looks really like you know brand new <laughs> right and I have been working on this farm guys uh, all I did just put lots of wood around the you know as a fancy uh, let me show you from the inside so i put fences all around this place and i put these um to lighten the place in the night time i need to take all that with the hell you know the key stuff and okay i'll be taking all that way you know all that off as well so um, i love it before we used to do that bit and we got seeds now you don't get nothing <laughs> okay let's take them off now and yeah i'll be ooh, i need to put my diamonds in the house so yeah let's waste that i just made an iron one you know iron hoe okay that's done the iron one is better i believe it lasts longer but it's the same use anyway it's a little bit faster clever way in it honestly guys you know very very clever way you take the top of the you know the dirt from the grass to dirt and yeah it looks beautiful it looks like a proper landing you know land for a plantation and hopefully it will look nice farm as well i'm planning to build i have some bone meals in here ready so first and this is the most important to me is really important to do these watermelon farm and pumpkin farm because i need to save at least 64 of each of these seeds in this house you know for a rainy day and yeah okay these ones one on one off i'll try to do it now Hmm, actually that was wrong. Okay, and if I give you that and I break it, okay, collect the seed, which is cool. Yeah, so all of them will grow their plants to that side. And this is the watermelon. Right, and let's grow them quickly. I don't wanna wait kind of month <laughs> for them to grow. So I help them to produce quickly some stuff. So we have four pumpkins and five watermelons, guys. And you will get these stuff in the map as well. And you will find them in the first uh, bungalow <laughs> or a mini house or whatever you want to call it, small cave. Or <laughs> so yeah, leave that. When they start popping out, try to make some more and plant some more. Yep. And yeah, as you can see, guys, I moved that thing 
one two blocks away so all i did broke that side from here move the other side to the back and move that side in and the same on the sides and yeah and this is looking cool and yeah filled it up with water as you can see guys this is how i fill it up you know you just all i did on the bottom level i put some uh i'll show you how normally do it but don't use cobblestone you will be confused one two three and imagine that and i put all the water above all that you know i put all that cobblestone and when i put the water all i did is just spray the bottom ones again and have a nice deep pool and it's up to you guys if you want to make it really deeper you can so yeah and i'm planning i don't know what to do in here but i'm planning to do some nice decorations i just put these posts I need to go to the nether get some glowstone and I made this water in here I dug them out as well with water and this is the other farm in there but this one is still empty as well I'm probably making that into wheat farm so I have a nice wheat farm in here nice watermelon and pumpkin seed you know and pumpkins farm in there and a nice animal farm somewhere maybe after I built some villages houses I'll make a big one as well and the house is still in here the bed the house <laughs> yep i decided as you can see guys i made this storage area a nice big massive storage area and in here i put all my precious items really really most important items i haven't put in anything in here i think i did in somewhere here no okay so I'm, i was planning to put some diamonds and stuff but i end up putting these stuff in here where is the that's the one so 49 diamonds beautiful beautiful i haven't got any more cds yet i need to go collect some more cds and i put all that these furnaces in there and wow okay this is cool all my stuff is cooked i'm gonna try to make i've been cooking and cooking lately so um you know smelting these couple of stones all right and let's put some yeah let's smell these ones and as you can see all that so you know what guys i'm going to make these the one i just collected into stone bricks mm, yeah because I, I needed lots of stone bricks but i'm thinking to keep some of these stones so yeah okay okay leave the rest i don't want to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, all right. And yeah, this is enough for now. Loads of them. Cool. This is so nice. All right. And this is the couple of stone I have. All right. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <coughs> one, two, three four five six seven eight i need one more coil so i've been doing some mining guys and i am trying to make mining now off camera because i don't think you want to watch me doing the minings and stuff like this so yeah because you know i think you had enough me mining but if any time I find diamonds, I try to show you the diamonds, maybe with a little bit of mining and stuff like this. I need to smell these ones, so um Yeah, let's let's leave them in here for now. I need to, actually let's make some more iron bars for the oh this I don't wanna use all of that, but yeah, let's see how many we can use for now. Wow this is enough 264s this is beautiful alrighty then yep this is so cool okay I'll be smelting these ones I hate when I have these you know stuff like this uh, hmm. let's make a spare one two three four furnace just for uh, quick stuff near me and you know sometimes when I'm doing some work I like to um, I don't want to put it in there so I'm thinking of putting it in there so I have everything I need in here chests and all that stuff 
but I'm a bit worried I probably won't see it. <laughs> Hold on, forget about it. And yeah, okay, you know what? This is the best place to put it in. Yeah, and let's get these stuff to smell. One, two, three, that will do 24. So we have like wasted only one, doesn't really matter. Okay. Okay, let's go and do the wheat farm. And yeah, where's the wheat? Where did I put the wheat? I've been doing some collecting this stuff. The wheat. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I put all my food in here and my plantation stuff in here. I got some cactuses as well. I need to do some more cactus. And let's take that one in case. Do we need it? I don't think so, but yeah, let's take it. Alrighty then, I wanted to make a nice, really nice village in here and I need to go to the nether and I need to go to the end and um, guys I will see maybe in this episode or the next couple of episodes I'll reveal where is the secret in this map so you could have fun as well and I'll give you the measures of these, you know, farms as you can see, let me count it with the wood, guys, because you're going to be needing the wood for the edge. Um, I stayed one block away from the house after these slabs. I put it all around the house. So one block from the slabs and the, the other farm as well, exactly the same as that one. So one block from the slabs, you have a dirt and you get wood. You count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 block long and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve block wide. So 21 by 12, as you can see, two blocks away from that wall and you get your woods as well, right? So this is the measures of that farm and you just put wooden planks for the flooring and the fences all around the area and uh, for the gate as you can see guys you use the fence gate and i put some decorations while well, it's up to you the way you want to do it as well so yeah and uh, these farms will make you have lots of food as well so it's important to carry lots of food on survival because it's very healthy <laughs> <laughs> make sure you do lots of sport guys so you don't put lots of weight you know it's very hard when you put lots, lots of weight and yep okay almost done come on I don't know it's a bit laggy my mouse I think or the computer itself is getting naked alright I'm glad I brought that one with me of these monsters oh yeah there's some in there okay now let's have fun reminds me of all the tractors <laughs> I love tractor guys you know honestly I love everything to deal with farming and stuff like this it's very nice you know it's the proper proper you know tasty food you get it with these farming when you farm it yourself And yep, oh, I don't have lots. Let's see how many can we.